Hello everyone, it's me again, Emmy with Black Swan, back again with another wig review. And this is on the company Superb Wigs. And they sent me this hair. There's still an issue with um, hair, um, with the materials to be able to make proper full lace wigs in China. So um, anytime I do advertise a wig, um, I implore you guys to jump on it because right now um, it's bad, okay? Hence why you see them making like headband wigs and hat wigs and beanie wigs and all that kind of stuff. So I implore you guys, whenever you do see something like this one I'm about to show you right now, jump on the deal. It's not their fault, you know, with this whole, it's, it's above my pay grade. It's above my pay grade. But what I can tell you is that whenever a company does give you like a 360 wig, girl, baby girl, you better jump on it. So they gave me the box with the mesh. You already know the drill. The wig, I have the wig cap, the extra band in there. You know, always a plus and then like the the tissue in the, in the, in there too. So this wig is a 360. You know how long since I've seen one of these? Sometimes I'll be posting my videos like kind of late, kind of dated. So like sometimes a month will go by before it actually goes up because you know me and the company have to be in cahoots. So for me to actually put my hands on one of these, it's like, girl, where have you been all my life? Like it, it makes my heart swoon because I know for them to be able to make a 360, uh, a 360 wig is it's not an easy task for me to take on right now. So I appreciate it to the utmost. But this company was able to do it. Thank you, Jesus. So this is the free lace part right here. And this part right here, as you can see, it is, kind of thick and so you're not going to get all the itching and irritation as you usually would on um on some of the other competitors so that's always a good mark and um these wigs always come pre-plucked look at that look look at that baby so they're ready to wear these wigs are like red to go absolutely red to go so as you can see, I got a fresh, I got my hair. My hair is natural, so baby, she laid her down, okay? She laid her down. And for those who are like a non-believer of, you know, actually having wigs as a protective style and be able to keep your hair healthy underneath the wig, I am a believer because I did go from the creamy crack to this. And mind you, my hair was extremely how can I say it? I onion hair. So while I put it in a ponytail, I look like an onion. Okay, I look like a fresh onion. Okay, I ain't have no hang time. My hair is breaking off. It was horrible, horrible. I honestly lost hope in my hair. I honestly felt like, you know what? It's a wrap, it's a wrap, it's a wrap. She, she's not ever gonna get back to the way she was. Okay, I've done too much dying and frying and laying to the side. Like, I just did too much to it. But, she's back to her full glory. And my, um, the girl that I have, she's, un you know what I'm saying? She's unofficial, but she gets me together. She washes, deep conditions my hair. And now, I went from having onion hair to absolute breakage to actually, my hair was, um, I was balding. Like right here, it was just naked, girl. Like she was, like there was no hang time. Like you couldn't grip the edges right here because there's just no hair. So now, you know, there's something there. So, just saying, just saying, you know, it, it helps. Wigs do help, especially right now in these winter months. I'm depending on them even more because the weather does dry out my hair even more. Mind you, my hair is, I would say it's, it's 4C. I would say my hair is 4C. Uh, don't quote me on that. I might be wrong. I'm still new to the natural hair game, okay? I'm not fully converted. I'm not fully educated on the game. So, um, 
I'm still learning. I'm still learning, hence why I have somebody doing my hair. So here's, <laughs> I feel like I'm rambling. So here's the hair. Okay. Here's the hair. I'm actually gonna take it and um, I feel like this is straight out the box, okay? And um, I'm gonna co-wash it. So just so you can see, this is how the hair looks because I do want y'all to get a clear photo, a clear idea of how it looks straight out the box. So you know, y'all think I'm trying to like dupe you or anything like that because that's the last thing I want to do. So here's the back. And then you have the option of putting it up in like a ponytail or something. Yeah, you have a lot of options for this hair. It's really, really, really cute. But um, yeah, so what I'm gonna do off camera is I'm gonna take very hot water and I'm going to dip the hair in like this. I'm gonna take it and I'm going to take the hot water, put it in like a little bucket. I have like a little white bucket that I got from um, Walmart. And so I'm gonna dip it in like this in conditioner and saturate it, take it out, rinse it out, and then I'm gonna refill the bucket with more hot water and then re-dip it in. I'm gonna keep doing that until there's absolutely no conditioner right to do in it. If you can do that, if you wanna co-wash your hair and or you can fully shampoo it, but I do recommend you dipping the hair and not taking the hair and like actually treating like the hairs on your hair because you know you're gonna you can mat the hair up because you know shampoo does dry the hair out and that's what you don't want to do so i just do it like that just dip it in make sure it's really saturated switch the hair around take it out and let it air dry so that's what i'm gonna do right now and then i'm gonna come back and then show you how the hair looks i feel like i look crusty on here girl like it's late at night but I got a husband, girl. Who am I trying to impress? Y'all already know me. Like, girl. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I almost forgot. Look at me. I'm forgetting. Okay. So, for those of you who like to know, you have the elastic bands on the back of the wig with an additional comb. Combs on the side, front. There's the other side. And then you have the additional attachments for the with the extra adjustable straps just in case you have a smaller head. So this wig is very versatile depending on your head size. So that's what we're gonna do. So yeah, I'll be back and then you'll be able to see how it looks after I co-wash this wig. I literally just took it out of the water and what I did was I just, con I didn't leave it in there overnight or nothing like that. I just took very hot water and very carefully without burning myself, dipped the hair in. The hair is towel dried, it's still dripping, okay? Cause I'm trying to go into detail exactly what I do. It's still dripping, okay? So what I do is I just keep taking up some of the drip with a towel. I'll keep trying to like squeeze some of the water out as much as possible, but the hair is still towel dried. And um, while still on the mannequin head, I will, add the Garnier Boutiste. Or you don't have to do that because it for me, I don't really see a difference between if I add it now or when it's completely air dried because I'm, I'm not gonna put any heat on it right now. I just want it to air dry. Also, let me go ahead and show y'all. This is how the hair looks now. So as you can see, straight out the box, it had a springier curl and then now the curl is looser. So for me, for me, for me, I feel like this is more of a natural curl. You know, straight out the water, air dried. I feel like it's a nicer, you know, curl. And straight out the box, I mean, you can wear it like that if you want to straight out the box, but straight out the box, it looked more like a heated curl versus a natural wave pattern. So I'm doing that. You know what? You know what? I'm just gonna go ahead and wait till it completely air dries for this hair. 
before I actually add the Garnier Fructis. And when I say Garnier Fructis, I mean this lovely stuff right here. Okay, this amazing concoction right here. What you talking about? Walgreens. Wal, Walgreens, excuse me, Walgreens. That's how you're gonna get it. I mean, I've been drinking orange Fanta on Burpee. Okay, we're back. So I already did my wig cap, you know. And um, here she is, nice and dried. I'm gonna rub my hot comb through her edges, make sure she's nice and laid down. And then I'm going to take this flat iron. This is my Baby Bliss Titanium Flat Iron that I got from Sally's. And uh, I'm gonna go through the hair with this. Um, I've done this several times, several, several. I think you're tired of watching me straighten out some hair. So, but these are the tools that I use. This is, uh, girl, this this was like from the beauty supply dollar store. I forgot, but it's cheap. It's cheap. It's cheap. Um, so you know, it, it, what, what brand is this? Girl, the brand is even wiped off. Like, girl, I don't know, I can't even tell what brand it is. All I know was like it was less than twenty. It, it was cheap. It was really cheap. It's nothing particular. But like, if you have a local beauty supply, you can hit up for a hot comb, a elect an electric hot comb. Do that. Get her. And um, yeah, so I'm gonna go through that, and then I'm going to let me show y'all the 360 on this wig one more time before I cut the lace and install her and show you all the finished look of this hair because I'm gonna do it off camera. So this is the back. Okay. Bring around this to the ears. They got like a little, you know, little sideburns on it already cut for you. This is the front part. The lace is really, really nice. They already have it pre-plugged for you. And here's the other side. The little sideburns already cut and bring it back around to the back so like i said before you have your options on this style of hair this hair has been air dried hence why it looks like this but yeah i'll be back and then you'll be able to see the finished look and i'll give you my final review on this way okay so she's on my head so um I did the usual wham bam. Now I did start straightening her and I decided I didn't like her straightened out because of the length. So I felt like I should have wanted her. So I went ahead and just used a wand and she used the barrel thing, you know what I'm saying? I went ahead and did that and I liked her a lot better. And cause I was like, you know, she deserves a little body yada yada. Like she deserves a little oomph in her. So it turned out really good. Uh, the hair is super soft and lightweight. I feel like the cap is very breathable. I don't feel hot. It was very easy for me to manipulate my edge line and lay the baby hair. You see, you, you see it? <laughs> you see the baby hairs? Okay, for the baby hairs, oops, oh, Lord. Uh, for the baby hairs, just use some, girl, I need to get together. Okay, so for the baby hairs, I use, this right here, my olive oil wrap set mousse. Wrap, wrap set mousse. So I use that. Took a little toothbrush, a little, the little edge brush. Soup, soup, soup. And then I just wrapped her down. I left her wrapped up for about 20 minutes. And then she was able to like lay down. I feel like I look really sophisticated. Like with the turtle neck. And I look like somebody's stepmama. And I ain't mad at it. So here's the part. Like the parting in this wig is really nice too. I really don't do parting that much in my videos. I need to show y'all the parts. But the parting in this wig is nice. It's very convincing. Very, very convincing. So you have, um, it goes back this far. You have a lot of room to do what you need to do, okay? The free lace is like half of my head. So it's, it's really, really good. So yeah, like. <laughs> Ooh, girl, I got my hair in my eye. Um, yeah, I ain't mad at it. Oh yeah, and then it, it feels healthy. Like the hair itself feels conditioned and healthy. Um, 
the one product that I did, the only other product that I put in my hair was the Garnier. I did put this in my hair and then this right here. Other than that, there's no product in this hair. It's just the hair was co-washed. I put the Garnier in it after it was dried up and it and then I added heat on it. Why am I so burpy? I'm still burpy. You know what? I need to quit doing that. I need to quit drinking these um, carbonated drinks right before a video. That's not good. I just need to stick to my waters and the lakes that I used to. So, uh, yeah, that's going to be it for this video. I recommend this wig. I hope y'all get it. And that's going to be it. Please like, subscribe, hit the notifications bell, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.